What is going on guys? Welcome back to another Ross Reviews and today we are out here in Brisbane, out in Queensland and we are checking out something really quite unheard of I guess is the word. Uh, this is a Berra Zuzu as the owner calls it and it is basically a Berra swapped truck. <laughs> I am not kidding you guys. This is the madman who created it, Paul. Hey, how are and, you? And uh, thanks so much for bringing it down. Let us have a look at this thing because, yeah, like Bear of the World, you've done that to basically the definition, I think, in this. So, yeah. <laughs> so what made you do this? Because, yeah, I, for one, have seen a lot of Bear of Swaps, but not one like this. All came about due to uh, the diesel motor being overheated, and the person driving it drove it to it, made a lot of noises, and just, uh, just, just went stopped. Bang! Yeah. <laughs> so uh, the diesel motor, this was pre-COVID. The diesel motor was hideously expensive to yep. replace. So we looked at a couple of options, and we came up with a Barra. And so, and uh, you got this Barra engine from a wrecker. Did I you, bought or, the, no, bought or bought from, the whole car from a wrecker? Bought a whole car from the auctions. Yep. Uh, ended up costing me just under eight hundred dollars delivered with auction fees and everything. That's that's a and deal. And it was still a drivable car. <laughs> I don't know if we can get those now because I haven't uh, I haven't seen any of those floating around for a while. But yeah, let's see if we can lift this. See what the uh, the barrel looks like here. Look at this. Just. There it is, that's a Barra. Factory fit. Factory fit. <laughs> I was gonna say, I'm actually surprised that it fits in there, because it was a four cylinder before. Yeah, it was a big four. Big four, yeah. 4.3 liter, four cylinder, 85 kilowatts. Yep. Uh, and, um, so I had an engineer fit the motor and gearbox for me, yep. and I did all the electrical myself. Yep. Man, it's it's tight in there, but it's in there, eh? Yeah, no. It fits like a charm, everything's plumbed up, air conditioning, power steering. Everything's good to go. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. And um, again, this is a working, a working truck. truck. Yep. <laughs> so this you like hire this out and stuff, yep. hey? And people, uh, people hire this truck to drive. Yeah. To move homes, to do whatever they want to do. Oh, mate. And, and uh, a handful of people that actually request this truck over my newer diesel trucks. <laughs> I believe it. I absolutely believe it. You know, the Ford fans will be going, yep, I'm moving home. Give me the Barazuzu. <laughs> So yeah, this is cool. All right, let's um, let's put it down. We'll go for a bit of a drive, guys, because uh, yeah, I just think this is too cool. I had to come and see this thing. <laughs> All right, so Paul, we're in the uh, Barra Zuzu, I think, as you call it. Barra Zuzu. And uh, mate, this thing, honestly, even just on the drive down here, you almost couldn't tell, really. No. I mean, besides the lack of a diesel sound, which. <laughs> You know, is what it is, but I, it, it's super smooth. It's quiet in here. We've got the BTR set up, eh? Yep. Yep. So originally this was manual, wasn't it? Yep. And um, so yeah, you've gone. You're telling me a story as well about having to get that from America, yep. because there's just not many here that are yeah, done. In this model, the uh, automatics were very, very few and far between. So yes. In America, they're all V8 auto. Yep. But uh, yeah, I mean, in terms of like, just feel of it, just driving, seems just like any other bear, super smooth. Yeah. <laughs> it kept it super quiet as well, it kept it standard as. Yeah, yeah, so it's just essentially a standard, was it a B series or um, BA? Yeah. It was a BA, and just a, it came from a XT standard run of the mill Falcon sedan. Yeah. It, yeah, it's just funny because again, you were saying, it's cheaper to do this, like, than to buy the new motor. Yeah. And well, an unknown second-hand motor would have cost me anywhere from probably about seven and a half to nine grand. Wow. Yeah, that's a ten <laughs> x difference of basically what you did. So. Yeah, and then um, for the fact that I could do all the electrical myself. Yep. That was the attraction to actually get find an engineer to do it, and um, yeah, he did a great job fitting it up. Absolutely. I guess that's the thing too, right? You know, when you hear all the the hype around the Barra and from, you know, one of the, arguably probably one of the best engines ever to come out of Australia, um, Barra the world this and, you know, Barra swap that. And 
to see it done again, you know, in a truck of all things like this, it really, uh, it really does show you that the barrel was so useful, I guess, in any real aspect. Like, yeah. you can put a barrel in anything, and it'll, it'll, it'll do the job. Go, Barrel Zuzu, go! <laughs> BTR, let's go, run it. <laughs> oh man, you gotta love it. You gotta love it. And um, again, what what weight is this probably now? Four tons. Four ton. <whistles> so yeah, she's got to move some weight, this old girl. And that's um, without any luggage in the back. So. <laughs> But I guess uh, I guess having the the these things were pretty torquey, so yeah. and then you've got the diff six one diff right here. Yeah, so it makes it a little bit lighter for it. Yeah, that's that's hilarious. I love this thing. Okay, here's the funny part. Yep. I've never been a passenger. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you know how many times that is get get said. <laughs> oh, I was waiting for that as well. You know. It is always quite funny. Oh man. But then yes, the Barazuzu. And this really brings me back to my uh, old truck driving days, guys. Because uh, for those who didn't know, before I started my YouTube career, I was a truck driver at one point. So <laughs> let's, uh, let's see how this thing goes. Make some deliveries. And um, there we go. Yes, yes, yes. Oh wow, just instantly taken off. It's just like nothing. Yeah. Seriously like nothing. <laughs> Guys, again, it's surreal. If you're driving an Isuzu truck like this with a bear underneath us, you know, good old BTR here, and mate, it's, it just cruises this thing. Turn right. All right, all right, yeah. The truck is 25 years old. And yeah, the fact the thing's 25 years old, you know, the Barra is probably, what, 15 years old nearly? Yeah, yeah, it's like four model. And, uh... Oh, 19 years old. Yeah, 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 20, yeah, just under 20 years old. <laughs> well, one of, there the, we go. one of the things I thought I was going to be up against is, um, this has got drums all around. Yep. So no discs on the front. Yeah, the brake pedal, you know, it, it, it's got a bit of squish to it, but it stops. Yeah, yeah, it stops all right. <laughs> Wouldn't expect it to be performance level, so... <laughs> but I gotta say, just, yeah, you can feel this thing just effort, effortless. Yeah, you don't need to really rev it out at all to just get it moving, and it's smooth. Far, far smoother than what it would have been in this thing. That, that little four-cylinder diesel would have been nowhere near this. The old Barasuzu, mate. <laughs> Four tons. <laughs> She's got to pull a lot, but you know what I mean, man. It's it's that down low smoothness that you can feel in this. But yeah, if you really wanted that speed, you could whack a turbo on this thing still. But <laughs> considering this is still a work truck at the end of the day, you know, it's it's doing well. This thing, it really is. Maybe if we go drifting, we'll put a turbo on it. Yeah, <laughs> could you imagine? <laughs> Yeah, turn and circle pass. Yep, here we go. You get on the BTR again. <laughs> Pulling that weight. Come on, the Barra Suzu, mate. <laughs> oh, it's good. Guys, again, if you're enjoying this type of content, this kind of just crazy stuff we can feature, you know, we're lucky enough to see. Hit that subscribe button, hit the like button. It really does help us out. And uh, again, just allows us to travel this great country and uh, bring this cool content to you guys at home. So again, hit subscribe. Yeah, this thing is wild. Alrighty, we're gonna test the uh, zero to 100 here. We'll reset the draggy once you're done your stop. Yep. Good to go. Good to go. Go, 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 go. <laughs> Marazuzu! Marazuzu the world! <laughs> Keep going! Keep going! Keep going! 
90! <laughs> Game 94, 96, 98, 100! <laughs> hey! You wanna know what the time was? <laughs> what do you think? 30 something seconds? <laughs> hey, not far off. It was quicker though. Was it? 28.97. Wow! <laughs> that was Zuzu, eh? Oh man. That is awesome, guys. I knew you guys would be complaining if we didn't do that test, so, yep. 28.97 seconds. Uh, so, um, cruise with 100, 3,000 RPM. Yeah, she'll do it. Does it all day. Absolutely. Drove it to Toowoomba last week for a job. Hey, right. yeah, again, how many Ks were you saying was on this now? Uh, the motor's now 300,000 Ks on. Yep. So she's uh, just freshly run in in uh, bear, bear terms, isn't it? <laughs> but yeah, again, you know, the, again, X you know, these things are for taxis, so um, they handle the K's really. You know, basic maintenance and drive it right. Yeah. They'll go. Yeah, that's awesome. Very cool. Again, guys, look, we're gonna finish the video off here. So again, Paul, massive, massive thank you. Appreciate that. Uh, this thing is just cool. It's weird. It's a barra. <laughs> and I love a good barra. So I had to come and see this thing while I was here in Queensland. And I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. So if you did, again, make sure you hit that like button. Consider subscribing if you're new here. And we will see you on that next video. Take care, guys.